So in this video, we are going to see what are view components and how we are going to use it and how we can code with this. So with that, welcome back to Bitfumes. I'm your host Sarthak and this is a channel where I talk about level view many things. So if you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and like Bitfumes on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. Okay, so let's get started because this is a eighth episode. So let's create the eighth one. So new file on hash eight which is called index.php okay simply uh, maybe <laughs> index.html okay so simply yes and as we always do yep paste it here and let's clean up everything so let's clean up this and this one also and this one also okay so we are all set to know what is components okay so first answer the basic question what are components so actually you have seen we have used div maybe if you are from html5 you know about a side is there this is good you know about article is there on the html5 but what if you want something like this my sidebar something like this how this will work so let's suppose you have a content where you are going to create some information so you have like information tag like that something like this is the test how about these things so obviously these things are not going to do anything because these are not available in your html markup but here comes the components these are actually the components you can create components by view so this is good we can create component but why I need these things? I have these things article aside div. The favorite one div we have. Because you have a whole bunch of quotes in a single page. Obviously many times we have. Then how will you know where is the sidebar? And your answer will be we will look for the sidebar. We will comment it somewhere or we know yeah I know it's on the uh, downside. It's I know it's on the upside but you know it's on the down up you have commented but what if someone else is going to take your code and how will he know obviously he can manage and he can look on the code and do some readings then after some time he will get the idea but the basic question is all these process takes time let's even suppose you are coming to your project after one year then obviously you have forgotten everything then when you come back and you will get this tag on your uh, HTML on your page then you will easily instantly know that yeah this is the information tag I want to do some edit in here or if you want on the editing on the sidebar you will find for a sidebar tag so these are the use of component these are the power of component and these are components so if you are convinced then let's go and let's see how we can create components in view so for that we have already created the new view instance so it is instance of view we have created but now I'm going to call a new view component so let's see how we can create actually new view component so firstly I type view dot component and then in the parenthesis the first parameter is the name of component let's say I want to create like sidebar we have talked about then I have to create the template so I will type template okay so now I'm going to 
give here whatever will be inside my sidebar so I will create sidebar like I have a div and inside div I have a class of let's say call lg4 here I have unordered list and here on the list so let's delete this one in the list I have a home I have a about I have a service and I have a bit fumes something different <laughs> okay service okay so let's see how we can call it so it's just a simple thing because we have created the sidebar and we don't have to do anything let's just go here inside our div let's call simple thing called sidebar and done yeah done so let's go and open the browser open chrome actually go here this page and you can see we have actually inside our html the sidebar we have but on our page we are getting the list item so let's just open console so that we can see we don't have any error that means everything is going correct let's inspect this element so let's see what we are getting whether we are getting sidebar or we are getting the div so you can see we have this div we have this so I will just zoom it out for you okay so I have these ul allies and everything is here and all these because of the components so you can see how much easy to write the component and even easy to use the component and now whenever you come back and whoever will going to see your code is just going to see yeah this is the sidebar okay so everything you do here inside the sidebar will going to take these things on your HTML so this is the view components and this is the power and this is the thing how we can use it in the next episode we are going more deeper inside the component so if you have not subscribed please go and subscribe to my channel so that you are not going to miss any of the video because I am having a block series having uh, uh, Laravel series and much more about the Laravel the best part of our channel and you can also like Bitfumes on the Facebook Twitter and Instagram so that you will get the latest update which are not here and we will meet in the next episode till then goodbye